How to create dynamic name ranges in Microsoft Excel. Hello everyone, welcome to Excel 10 tutorial. In this advanced Excel tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can create a dynamic name ranges. By dynamic name ranges, I mean whenever you add a value, your name range will auto update and include that value inside your name ranges. Okay, I have already created a tutorial on name ranges. If you want to understand it, you can watch the video and then come back to this one and create your dynamic name range. Okay, let's get started. <laughs> Creating name ranges require two formula which is offset and counter. For you to understand correctly, I'm going to write the formula here and then we will create our dynamic name range. Okay, first let me write the function here, write equal to and we're going to use the offset function which is O F and you can see this is the offset function. Double click here, cell reference, that means the first cell, we're going to start our name range from cell C2 because C1 is the header and I don't want to add this inside my ranges. Okay. First, I'm going to write the worksheet name, which is backend, followed by exclamatory, then the cell reference, which is C2. And I'm going to press F4 to make it an absolute references. Then I'm going to press comma. It moves to the next parameter, which I don't need. Then I'm going to press comma again. That will move to the next parameter that I don't need also. Then I'm going to press another comma and it will move to the height. And here we are going to use another function that is counter function. C O U N. And you can see here counter selected and select same way we are going to give a value here which is our starting point again worksheet name followed by exclamatory and the cell references press f4 to make it absolute references now we are going to count from cell c2 and let's say i want to add up to cell c500 so i'm going to add a colon here and now i'm going to write cell c500 let's make that absolute also and now close parenthesis and close parenthesis again to complete function okay now press enter this is the function we are going to use in our dynamic name ranges okay now by counter function we are going to count all the cell that has any value whether it's text or number it doesn't matter if you have a value in this data range it will count it okay so take the function from here and now let's click on the formula tab and click on name manager now we are going to create new so i just write new and here the name will be dynamic expense which is d y n underscore expense this is the name of my dynamic name range and here in the cell range we are going to remove it and we are going to paste the formula we have just written and if i click ok our name range is ready now how you can check your name range is working go to the name manager manager double click on the name click on the cell reference here and you can see this part is selected that means we have our name range ready let's add a value here and if i go to the name manager and select that again and click on the cell range you can see our new text has been added to the selection that means our dynamic name range is working this is how we can create dynamic name range in microsoft excel this is what i wanted to show you thank you thanks for watching see you in the next tutorial if you can support the channel through patreon and don't forget to subscribe thank you thanks for watching